Hello Taurus, thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 26th of June. The passionate side of your nature is certainly going to be to the fore this week, but it might be about your ideas as much as any other issue. In fact, we often have the things that we really base our lives upon, our belief systems, and these are going to be very much under the astral microscope. If you do encounter someone who has a diametrically opposite view to you this week, it could lead to some conflict. I have to be really honest about this, because with Mercury and Mars combining in the part of your scope to do with everyday communication, your mind is going to be competating discussions very rapidly. And this could, especially in the sign of cancer, for us all, see us jump into conclusions, making assumptions, and that's something we all need to avoid. But in your case, it could be something much bigger, something that's much more important to your future. You may find yourself at some kind of crossroads, and there could be some big, very important thinking and discussions to be had. It's possible you may even be talking to some kind of advisor or legal counsel, particularly over an agreement, or if it's not gone so well, resolving a difference with someone. Taking a fixed position is probably not the best of ideas, so try to stay as fluid as possible. Keep the lines of communication open, for diplomacy is going to be very important. In fact, the first two days of this week, you could have a fantastic connection with someone who really appreciates your enlightened way of looking at something. But just as easily as the week goes on, there could be someone you encounter who, as I say, may see things very differently to you. I think what we all need to remember this week is that everybody is entitled to an opinion and just because it's different to us, it doesn't make them a bad person. It may make them someone we don't want to hang out with, but at the end of the day, they are entitled to that view. So I think the mantra for you this week is agreeing to disagree. That can be a very useful way to approach things. Now, by the end of this week, there is also a quarter moon. And this is a quarter moon, which is just encouraging you not to try to pack in too much to the weekend as this week draws to a close. Give yourself some priorities. Focus on those first, and that will mean that you're spreading your energy less and being much more purposeful in what you can try to achieve. The other thing that can be very important for you this week is travel. Anything to do with widening your horizons can really excite you. And in fact, the everyday grind could seem much duller than usual. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now. Hello, thank you so much for watching my video. I'd love you to join me at my Horoscope Ace app. You can find this at www.horoscope-ace.com. You can use it through Android, iOS, Apple or Facebook. Check out your Ascendant or your Moon site or download your free birth chart. There's all your favourite videos, plus there are daily, weekly, monthly and yearly horoscopes for general, love, Chinese and Indian astrology. If your passion is tarot, there's my brilliant three-card money or love tarot readings too. And it's all there at www.horoscope-ace.com. Thank you.